Hello YouTube, so today I'll be making another Minecraft ScreenFlow performance video because I saw a lot of you were interested in that so I'll make a better one with commentary also so I can describe the performance a lot better so we load up in um, a freshly opened up Minecraft window and pretty much we're just gonna play around with Minecraft and see how many frames per second I get so, currently it's at 60 frames per second while recording. This is on a super flat map. And uh, let's start building. So, pretty much, I'm going to plug in my mouse. And you can see it's fairly stable. running well. Let's put a bit of TNT. See if there'll be a reaction to TNT. Still running very smooth. So before I blow this up, serve you one more time. So I'm far under distance fast. Turned off smooth writing, lighting, so it's turning like this. So I'm bright, let's put all of the particles. Clouds on, server textures on, advanced open GL. And it's still around the same. See now I feel a react. Budge down from So it kind of dropped to around 20 as you can see. There's a bit of lag. Over here, but I mean it's very it's very stable in the sense. See over here again, there was a blue block. If you load up a bigger, more demanding map like this one, I mean, 17 frames per second. It's not very good. 20 frames. Still not very good. Even when everything is done. I mean, it's fine, I suppose, but it's not very smooth. And I'll just be continuing playing on Minecraft around here. And you guys can see how many frames I get. It's a lot smoother than QuickTime, that I can say. Uh, QuickTime got around 15 frames the last time I tried it. I also have a video on my channel of uh, ScreenFlow versus QuickTime. There was a considerable difference. Also, I find QuickTime sometimes glitches out with the keys. I was playing Minecraft and left clicking, and it was taking it as though I was right clicking. And it just wasn't even playable from my point of view, which I really dislike. Uh, this one, from my point of view, is pretty smooth, except sometimes when I export the video, it turns out to become laggy. And I don't really like that. I don't really find it very nice. Like, it's smooth for me, but you never actually know what's happening on the end of the user and I've had several complaints about ScreenFlow that it was laggy so yeah I hope you enjoy this video I hope this video helps you uh, currently my Mac is running on um, Best Pro Retina I have the baseline MacBook Pro Retina and yeah I hope this video helps and uh, thank you very much for watching this video please like and subscribe and Stay tuned for future videos. If you have any suggestions, please leave a comment below. Uh, I'll try to upload more videos, more quality. So that means with uh, commentaries, rather than just a normal voice with no audio. But I'll try to also keep the quality of the video up, meaning uncompressed, just so that it'll stay nice and uh, solid. So yeah, bye bye everyone.